Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's nice. My God. Oh, man. Yeah. You can get a whole family in there. Yeah, well, <laughs> you're going to have to be from the Appalachian Mountains to get them all in there. Gosh. Look at everybody. Look at everybody run away from the camera. <laughs> oh, my gosh. We are up here at the sales lot. We got the cleaning crew. We got the technical crew. We got the electricians. We got the salespeople. <laughs> so, oh, well, excuse me. We got a proper title. Solar man. <laughs> In this gorgeous day, I love this. Look at that sky, man. Cloudy, rainy, a little cool. But the power's running. And look at this baby right here. This is it. A 24 foot. Melody, could you hold this for me? And you could, or, or you know what? If you're too cold, have the guys do it. But we're gonna. I don't. We're, we're trying not to be here very long. But this is our debut. Man and I did a video of it inside the shop. And now we're out here in the sales lot. If you guys want to come and see this $25,000 house, this is amazing. This We made this thing 24 foot long. One of the guys said, you get a whole family in there. You know what? Well, we're going to take you inside and show you. You maybe have seen what a man and I just did. We got Lucas. Lucas, come on over here. And uh, Lucas is going to explain the amenities, the solar, and what goes on this 24 footer. And then we'll go inside. All right. All right. So... On the 24 foot unit that we got here, we've done solar on both sides of the roof. And if you look just over there for a moment, those ground mounts, yep. you can put even four more on the ground. So in between the two carts over there, there's slanted ground mounts, he calls it, with extra panels. So you could add more panels to this house, right? 12 of them. 12 of them. Yeah. And there's eight on this right now. Yeah. So the time you're said and done, you could have almost 4,000 watts. Wow, what's yeah. on this house right now? Uh, let's see, we've got uh, 350s, that's uh, 600, there's like 2,400 watts on this roof right here alone. And that's per hour, right? Per hour, yes right. sir. Gotcha. All right, we got we got two lithium batteries in here. Yes sir. In in our, our sales that we have right now, you get four panels, a lithium battery, charge controller for 7,500 bucks. Right. We can throw another four panels on the roof on the other side, we can throw another battery in there, all this is on the amenities, and if you can add up to five amenities, you'll get 25% off of those five. That's like if you get $16,000 of little amenities, we're going to knock four grand off that thing. That's right. Which is amazing, right? All right, so as you guys can see, there's no electricity running of this thing. This is full power. Got the little light bulb on. It doesn't take a lot of energy. To learn light. We probably got a little DC battery in there running it. But we're going to go inside, show you that makeup. If you guys want a solar... Go on there. This is a big sale. It ends New Year's Eve night. You guys got to get on here. We'll only take a deposit. If you don't have all your money right now, we'll take the rest of it in February when we start building these things. This is our sale that gets us to the winter. All right? Melody is freezing. All right, let's get you in the house. All right? Hey, before we do that, what? It is on in there? Can we show them this bay window and walk around this a little bit, Melody? Now, if you're too cold, I can get one of the boys to do this. Lucas, get over here, okay. buddy. And I've got something here I'm going to show you guys later when we go inside. Now, this, this bay window, it also has a, uh, a new feature inside we'll show in a minute, the, yeah. uh, the, the storage shelf yeah. above it to utilize that space. The guys have been playing around with this, trying to add amenities. Just, I, I like it because we get excited about building homes here. And everybody's flipping out when they go inside and see how big it is, you know. Um, it's just like the regular Incredibox but we put a gable roof on it. Same floor plan, made it eight feet longer than a 16 footer. And you still got your 3040 windows. You got your 203 up here in the kitchen. And uh, I tell you, you won't have to walk your all the way around. We'll go into the front. Now, one thing I want to tell everybody, if you're in the state of Tennessee, think about this. You could buy this $25,000 house, put it on an acre ground if you wanted somewhere. And this can be a primary residence. We are working right now to get an FHA HUD approved loan. It, because it's modular certified, you guys can get a 30 year note on a 25 grand. And if you buy a lot and everything for 50, I bet your payments over 30 years would be probably what, $262 a month. Stupid. This is a game changer for us as a company, for you guys, primary home. So you guys can keep this. This is a starter family home. This is for a young couple, single parent, single person. This would be great to have somebody come in and you guys start your life right here at 25 grand. Now, when all your friends and family are paying $1,200, $1,000, $1,500 a month in rent, you're paying under $300. Yeah. That's, Facts. that's crazy. This is life-changing. I feel like I need to hear the, the trumpets playing. Angels sing. 
Yeah, I need I need to hear noise. I need fireworks going off. This is major, major news, right? Yeah. And then I got something here to get you rich. Come on in here. I'm excited about this thing. All right, Melody, we're gonna get you warm. Oh, it looks so good. They even spray perfume in here. Oh yeah, we we you should have seen I was in here with the broom oh, just going ninja man. mode earlier. Now Melody, you show what you think they want to see and we can talk about this house and like I said Amanda and I just did a video on this look at the amount of space in here and that eight foot room you know if you add that on you're coming yes. about right there look at this little shelf up here yeah so I'll get up here so this is what Lucas this is about what 14 15 inches yeah yeah so yeah. we we took uh we didn't go too wild with it because didn't know you know like if like yeah. we were talking about if they added the room separation, yep. you could actually put another one here, you sure know, and could. have storage and right. just trying to maximize wow. all the space that we have now. Yeah, I see what you're saying. So this is just to show you that the, the shelf could be wider, it could be further, and we can custom do that. If you guys say, hey, I want a four footer, we'll do that for you. Right. Right. Um, and, and again, I, you know, in the, the video that Amanda and I did, we can put a partition wall here with a barn door. And like Lucas said, if we go up, you can either leave the top open for the air to flow and just have a partition to put a sofa or a table against, right? right. It gives you more room to put furniture. Sure. But if you want to close it into the gable, you can put another shelf on that wall going into the room mm -hmm. and you could actually put one on the living room too if you wanted. Yeah, and I didn't even think about that. I right, know it. Right above, because that track, yeah, where the track's going to fall, we yeah. guys could literally go right above that. Good. Yeah. So, so could you put an egress window up there? You could do that too. Okay. You could put an egress window here. Amanda actually wanted to say, well, what if you had did not have the batteries up there and you put an egress there? You know, you could put a small person up there, you know, and sleep, but you put it gotta have an egress window to get out of this thing. Um, our mini split, this is an extra amenity. The house does not come with a, a, um, a mini split, but if you guys can get five amenities or more, we'll knock 25% off. The coolant line comes up in here and turns inside. Perfect layout for manufacturing. Over here coming up, we got all our panel box, all of our thing. I was telling the video with Amanda that this sticks out. And I know why, because of the roofs well, goes down. We were going, as long as it was good with you, we were going to lower this just a little bit and, and it allowed it to go the rest of the way. The up. only thing is, is that that refrigerator, the 10 cubic foot is 60 inches tall. Oh, okay. And that was the reason we had that height. Now. If it's that's something you can do. Now, the only other thing is I thought you could make this door a little bit narrower, just yeah, bring everything out, out if okay. you wanted to. Well, now we can do that if you want to do yeah. that. So I think this is about what 32 inches now. Yeah, we tried to get that as close to know. you know the the standards on handicap accessible as possible. And, and I yeah. think I think we come out four three four inches and make it about 30 what 28 inches. I mean that I think that'll be fine. Um, but we can get a request if you think you got to have a bigger doorway, we can make it like that. We're getting really good in the manufacturing line that if you want any kind of little amenities added to your home, a little bit of changes, the guys can do it. You know, we couldn't do this last year. Right. And now we can because we're learning the process. And manufacturing has been a, man, it's been a challenge and a half. Yeah, it's exciting. No, this was built in two and a half days. Done. Our usual turnaround, 72 hours from one end of the building to the yeah, other. Yeah. This went out today in two and a half days. Everything is just getting faster and faster. Yeah. And faster. I like the roof line. I like how it's made. I like that the panels are vertical instead of horizontal because it's a gable roof. I love that. Um, it increases the snow load capacity on these homes if it goes up really north. So the whole thing, the, the size of it, is what's bl mind blowing here. 25 grand. This is a amazing. I'm actually thinking, I talked to him early. I've been I've been living in a 16 foot in credit box, and I'm actually I think the guys are gonna try to get me one of these, you know. We're going and top tier. Go stand, go stand all the way in the bathroom. <laughs> okay. And I'm gonna stand all the way back here. I'm not even all the way in the bay window. I know, isn't this something? Look how much space this you is. can pass football. <laughs> That's right. You <laughs> could amazing. 24 <laughs> foot long. It's amazing. just so, Melody, let's come in here, and I want Lucas to describe the solar and what's okay. going on. Um, the, we'll start with the two lithium batteries that you can see. Yeah, now we, we also got something really cool about to start going on with that is that we have um, an ABS heavy-duty uh, polymer okay. that's going to be the frame built now for even more strength. Oh, wow. For and the battery Me and Bart's been working on that, and so it'll be black. 
and it's solid black and it'll blend right in with the batteries. Nice. So nice. yeah, that's that's hopefully. You know what I like about this is that I came up, of course, we know with all this, the house and the manufacturing and all that. But now I love seeing your ideas and other guys' ideas and everybody now is is contributing to a better home. Oh yeah. You know? And I'm I, I that it makes me feel good that you guys are actually contributing to the design too, you know. Um, you know, we, uh, every one of us want to give people a really good home. Absolutely. And this is a legacy. You know, yeah. like somebody, every screw got put in, somebody put that screw in. And, you know, from the guys that work in the night now to the guys that work in the day, we all exactly. want to give people a good home and leave a good legacy. That's hard. That's hard for people to believe that, that the guys putting the screws in are actually thinking, I want to give somebody a good home. You know, people don't think like they're thinking most people, oh, just get, get this done so I can get done at 4 o'clock and get to the, you know, get to the house or something, you know. We here are so grateful, especially being in this part of the country. Sure. We don't have a lot of money. Most of us raised up poor around here. And in this part of the county, it's hard to come by with a good job. And we're, we are trying to be the best paid company in the country. And we're trying to get our guys are going to make astronomical amount of money. And I've told them we'll give them that. If we can become a successful company in 2024 and can increase this productivity, I'm sharing that with the guys. And I think it's finally sitting in because I'm proving what I'm doing. And I'm giving things. We're trying to get benefits and things that we're doing. Um, I'm trying to facilitate that mind frame that people aren't just coming here and punching the clock. They're coming in here oh, and they're yeah. building a home like, like what Melody lives in. Yeah. She lives in one of yeah. our homes that the guys put together. And, and some of the guys are delivering the homes and they're seeing the people that live in them. Yeah. And they're like, whoa. Yeah. Now I know I put that screw in crooked and you could see it from her bed, you know? Yeah. And so they're thinking about it. Oh, it's 100%. It's not just the house, it's the home. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, when that's a difference. people buy something, you know, for, for a lot of people, they may just think, like, you work in the automotive industry. Well, it's mm -hmm. just another car going down the road. Yeah. That's somebody's vehicle they're going to drive the next 20, 30 years. Right. Somebody buys a home here, that's their forever home. You know, Absolutely. we're not just building a material thing, we're building somebody's hopes and dreams that day. But, you know, that goes, that when that house rolls out the door and hitches up at the end of the day, somebody's hopes and dreams just got manufactured that day. This is a legacy because, like you said, but it's metal. So their two by fours are not going to rot. No. The windows, if they ever leak, they ain't going to rot the wall. Nope. It's like, I don't, I couldn't tell you how long this thing's going to last. No. You know? Okay, I didn't interrupt you. No, no, so no. Okay, so, yeah. so the off grid, <clears throat> we've got the louvered vents so that, um, that we've doubled up on that so that to help dissipate the heat and uh, try to ventilate as much as possible on the bottom. This is the updated uh, system that the guys put in now in the off-grid department. Travis's guys are just killing it. This is a 48-volt system as opposed to the 24-volt system that we put in in the past. The difference is you can put so many more panels to it. Okay. Um, you can load this thing down with batteries. I mean, you literally are your own power company now. Wow. And, um, and it's shielded. Um, you know, it's got the DC EMP shielding. You can put the AC EMP on your house to protect you from the utility uh, input power coming in to you. We can put multiple breakers in here for up to three different strings of panels and still keep it all in a compact setup. And if for any reason there was ever an issue, it's easily replaceable, swappable out. And this will put out 5,000 watts of power in your home. So if you want to have a block party, you can have a block party. That's every want. hour. Oh, yeah, yeah. 5,000 5, watts, watts man. man. So like That's in, 50 amps. Well, if you, if you look at it like you have a 1,000-watt microwave. So you've got yeah. dinner cooking. Yeah. You turn on your water heater. There's 1,800 watts. So you're 28. you got your pump running. Yeah. So that's pulling power. Um, and you're in there taking a shower. So yeah. your dinner's cooking. Your water's hot. And you're taking a shower. Then you get out. The lights are on. TV's loaded up, Netflix is waiting for, you know, your popcorn and your dinner. <laughs> and there you go. You You're never in my house, beat. buddy. You never missed a beat. I know, right there. <laughs> yep. And, uh, and that's it. I mean, you don't have to worry about it. Now, the, everything in here, now, we've tried to curtail this too, though, that the one thing about it is it just needs to be 120 volt appliances. So yeah. the washer dryer combo thing needs to be 120 volt if you put that in the house. But otherwise, you can run any appliance you want, multiple appliances at the same time. Now, I wouldn't just run it, run it, run it to kill it. You know, yeah. like these get, oh, if these ever get overheated, they will temporarily shut down, let the transformers cool, and then restart. 
Okay. Um, and the you know the manufacturers on this and the warranty they've been phenomenal about if we had an issue right. uh, midnight actually sent out parts they're like here we'll send you anything you need I yeah. mean they've been really good to us in the past year and normal people that normally people that are on off grid solar they have a consciousness about power usage sure. so they're always kind of being frugal about what they use and trying not to do that so that's why we have no issues with these that we've sold. What you made the comment? We meant well, five hundred of these things. Okay, so three hundred. So we've we've bolted down. Prob okay, so our statistics on different various models of homes: it's fifty percent to thirty something percent get off grid in okay. some capacity, whether okay. it's rain catchments, off grid power, or, or combo. We've replaced, I think, eight of these out of like five hundred inst. I've, I'll wow. be honest with you: the guys have bolted down so much off grid, I've kind of lost track. I mean, wow. like me and Brian are, and Amber are moving houses off of lists every day that's going out. And if you factor that in, that's like 1%. Uh, that's and that's well within the margins. And furthermore, anybody that's had an issue, we've just replaced it. Yeah. Like straight up, here you go. Here's a new battery or here's a new inverter. Yeah, cool. And it's been phenomenal. I'm, I'm kind of shocked as that that industry I used to work in, you could have a... I won't say manufacturers because I don't want to throw them under the bus, but certain yeah. top tier equipment that I hung brand new out of the box. It was a $7,000 piece of equipment. Yeah. And it was dead brand new out of the box. Mm. And I'm like, man. And of course, they warranty to replace it, but people don't understand that how much in the off grid industry inverters wire out. Yeah. Batteries have to be replaced. Sure. Things happen. I mean, a tornado came through in Kansas and tore up, you know, that huge install, yeah. tore up that dude's whole install. No. Wind turbines, everything. Insurance company, I guess, going to take care of it. Wow. But a tornado tore out that. But, you know, various things happen from regular failure to just stuff. Yeah. And it is amazing how much I've went out and done service calls in the almost decade I've done off-grid. We don't really do that here. Because I know when we started <coughs> this, your fear was, oh, oh my God. Oh, I, I was in I, I, I was just, We could run into a mess here if things start going bad. Oh, I had an absolute panic. I mean, I'm yeah. like... Did they call? I, I had probably had an anxiety attack multiple times up in the office because I'm like, we're going to have service calls. We're going to have service. And calls. How are we going to afford this? Yeah, yeah. But it hasn't been a thing. Off grid. It's because you thing. get this tech. You've got this down, and it's checked and pre-checked and set up and gone. It's it's phenomenal how you put this together. I appreciate that. Yeah, it's buddy. fun watching the guys now that do the off grid. Yeah, they just yeah, you've trained them, and then they flick the switch on it. Like Travis just walked in there casually, turned everything on for him, and then just left. God, <laughs> they they've gotten it really down. And the guys at night too, they just they just build it, and it's just, and they yeah. just walk off. They know it's right. Yeah, that's what really makes my day. Yeah, you know? yeah. It, it, and and I, I was telling, I think in a video earlier about how. The delegation of what I used to do is delegated now, and it, I love delegating because when I when I don't even think about solar anymore. I don't think about the manufacturing part of it because we've got some really great guys that are holding the torch, and I don't worry about it. I yeah. really it's made me feel so good because a lot of business owners want to micromanage. Mm -hmm. I ain't that way, man. I'm I'm I've got now more stuff on my plate because I've laid that down. And now I got other things on my plate that I can continue on to help the company. Sure. And it, it's, it's so enjoyable to see this happen. But we can't make it without you guys. No. We got to sell homes. And that's why we're here is to show you this beautiful home for $25,000, 24 foot long, 36 inch shower. The solar is an amenity that you can add on. We've got different types of solar that you can put on. You know, the one starts out about 7,500 bucks. Yep. You can add batteries to it. You can add panels to it. And you can compare everything that we're doing and go into the solar world across the country and Google everything and compare our prices. Guaranteed, we are thousands of dollars cheaper than anybody in the country. Yeah. It's installed. Nobody's doing it on a tiny home. Well, anyway. You know, uh, one thing about that, Randy, is that just from years ago, uh, from doing off-grid, mm -hmm. is that we used to charge people $3,000 just to do the labor. That was just the labor. That wasn't parts. Wow. And I mean, that turns into thousands and thousands. Yeah. I mean, uh, and you were you were very economical in your cost. The reason I got to work across the country was I was always like two thirds or a half cheaper than anybody else out there. And that's um, and that's so, the way we are here. Yeah, and yep. I mean, I've compared what we've done for people, and I'm like, there's yeah. there's just no comparison. Yeah, and right now I'm I'm doing my sales kick is that five amenities you get twenty five percent off. So if you buy this right here, you can get 25% off of this with four more amenities added to. Do the EMT, you know, EMP, I mean, do a bay window, mm -hmm. do a picture window. Uh, you know what I thought was really cool? Is you can get four big money uh, 
uh, amenities, right? If you want to. You got to get five, right? And you're like, mm, what am I going to get? Throw a spare tire in. 150 bucks. Done. I got five. Done. Done. And now you yep. got 25% off, you know? So that's cool. So we've made it good for you guys. We've made it fun for us. And this is this is exciting. All right, Melody, what I like to do is him and I get in this bay window. Okay. And I'm going to explain something I have in my hand. <clears throat> well, I'm going to let Luke do it. Okay. Luke, there you go. All right. And Melody, you can get as close as you think the guys need, people need to see. This is the bay window that you all can have $2,500 in this 24-foot home. Lucas, I'm so proud of him. I've known him for nine, ten years now, and he's got two kids. He's married. He's just, uh, he's like a son to me, and he goes home, and he doesn't just sit. He's, he's so smart. You guys can't see everything that he's got going on. He's got something here that I want to be, I want to, I want to add to these homes that we do, and I want him to explain what this is, and I'm going to tell you what we're going to try to do. Okay, so, um, I, outside of the walls here, when I'm not helping Randy, I own a crypto mining company and we set up data centers. We build and manufacture mining products now. We do a little bit of everything. And so I designed a crypto miner that uses one watt of power and it only costs about $2 a year to run it. And it's a solo miner. So as opposed to a normal crypto miner that runs as a, a community pool working tool, this individually looks for a block of Bitcoin. And long story short, is if you found that block of it, it's about worth a quarter million dollars. And somebody just recently solo mined a block of Bitcoin. In 2021, when I sold uh, my off-grid business and walked away from it, and then or started the process of selling, and I still done some work, but uh, when I started this crypto mining business, I found two blocks of Bitcoin. But I didn't get to keep it because I was in a community pool. It. But it's not unachievable in any yeah. means. And um, so we built this. Now, I remember Elon Musk, he got out of, he sold some of his Bitcoin because he said mining Bitcoin was so uh, energy, not energy efficient. efficient, right? Yeah. We're talking this will mine Bitcoin for $2 a year. Right. But now... Granted, it doesn't constantly pay to your wallet. No, no, but no. It, but if it did, find it. This is a one and done. This is like it. either you get it all or, or nothing. nothing at all. But, so you can plug this up and just walk Forget away. It. Yeah. So this one, <clears throat> this is the one I brought for Randy. I'm going to borrow his for yep, a minute to explain. This is uh, the device right here. So, and now he won't do this, but he built everything. He designed the box, the logo, the print. There's so many technological things inside here. I want you to tell all the people that's involved in what you did. Okay, so um, Roger that's over in Spain, I got with him and we done some code changes and things to- Spain over, over there. Over there in Europe, Across yeah. The pond. And currently I've got Philip working on boards in France. France. And um, the Lily Company produces the boards for us in China. <laughs> and, and Ben and his wife currently print the design that me and Ben worked on. He's got for a 3D the, printer here in And Newport. I gave Ben all my printers, so he has his printers plus my printers running 24-7. And uh, he handed me off a whole two cases of them in the dark of the night the other night. Oh, I, <laughs> and, then, um, and then I assemble them, and then uh, John and Brody starting to help me assemble them too. So this is, this is the device, and it is super tiny. And... We don't, I didn't have the uh, stamp yet for the, um, the, the ink that we put over the, the, the embossed part, but we're going to have that more professional looking soon. Um, I just got one off the press as quick as possible to give to Randy. I love gift. your logo. Uh, yeah, uh, the reason we call it Black Flag Crypto Mining because a lot of the world's governments, they look at cryptocurrency as like piracy and you know, avoiding things. And the thing is, it actually gives people financial freedom. I've paid for groceries, doctor bills. Uh, I think I paid part on Aaliyah's birth <laughs> bill yeah. at the hospital. I paid uh, vehicle payments. My mom and dad buy groceries monthly. I run a crypto miner in my crypto farm for them, and I take mom money all the time. I, I mean, that is such a good feeling, That's taking cool. my mom and dad money. Yeah. And I help pay for their home doing this. I can't even begin to tell you the stuff I paid for. Yeah, how many crypto. miners you got at the house? Oh, dear. We're in the hundreds. <laughs> I mine with cell phones. Uh, A6, uh, if you've seen my crypto farm. His poor wife. I mean, he's got wires run all over the house. Uh, if you came by the, with a Geiger <laughs> meter, the radiation from our where yeah. we live, it's probably oh off gosh. the charts. It's pinging the thing. 
<laughs> he was he was heating his house from the miners, right? This is true. Yeah. And so um, what you do is you just plug this. Did you in. want to plug it in down there and turn it? Oh on? yeah, that's right. We got work. We, we got power. Uh, fiddle. Sorry. Yeah, you're all right. I'm a little cold too. I'm oh, I know. Well, I've been standing out in that rain all day. No, it's cold. We're all cold. Let me We're flip. used to hot weather. Around. Okay, so I look at the screen. And uh, so what you do is you just scan the QR code and you'll put your Wi-Fi in for where you live. Yeah. And then um, once you've logged into the miner, you'll put your Bitcoin deposit wallet in for your crypto wallet, and then it'll queue up and it'll start running. And it has multiple screens. It has a clock screen. It also tells the current price of Bitcoin value. It's a it's a stock ticker, and it also tells you um, it, it's also a miner. And so whenever if it finds a block and it goes from zero to one, payday is coming in about twenty four hours. And whatever you choose to spend it on, may the odds be ever in your favor. <laughs> yeah. Because I mean it's it's good times ahead, and I mean. As a as a miner, I've actually physically mined into the tens of thousands of dollars of Bitcoin in farm mining. Right. But this here, if somebody uses this and found a block, they're they're in a good spot. This is the up and coming thing because it's so cost effective to run. You just plug it in and forget it. Two dollars a year to run this thing, and and you can just check your phone periodically and see if you got it or not. It may never hit. No, but no. But then it might. But why not invest in something like that? It, it, you know what? It's like buying a lottery ticket every day and not having to pay for it. Well, the, the reason that I, I love this project so much is people that's never understood crypto. Yeah. It, it, uh, our app helps them learn. They, they, it, it walks you through the steps of what you need to put in. Got it. Um, and then not only, yeah, and it helps uh, you know, show people what's up. And then the next thing about it is, too, is you're supporting that blockchain worldwide. And so that ledger is being upkept and I mean there is a huge monetary value of Bitcoin now. Wow. And um, and it's you know like you 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 look at a lot of countries they're even accepting it at legal tender in places. Yes. Mm -hmm. And so um, you know it's an opportunity for people to help themselves. And uh, and yeah this is this is the electronics. So There's the, the electronics. electronics. Look at this. And uh, so you come up with this man. The, that little that little item right there with what the firmware that's been put into it. Show um, the back side of that. Uh, That's just so interesting. Look at that. Yeah. Wow. So here's uh, something else. You are <laughs> amazing. Yeah. You. I appreciate Randy uh, because you know, ten years ago we started building in the backyard, and boy, we've we have had some adventures. <laughs> you you've I'm, trucked homes across the country. Oh, I'm, I'm, oh my god. We've gosh. done a little bit. Of, it's been some of the best years of my life. I'll be honest with you. And this past year has been. My favorite, it's been such a joy to watch something that started in a humble beginning to now when I pull in the parking lot, I'm calm for about 10 minutes and then I sit down in the office and I'm like, oh my gosh, we got to spend it starts like, we've got to spend $300,000 down, you know, Alyssa loves me. Oh, oh you know. <laughs> I know. You come up in stairs, she goes, oh God. Alyssa sees me and she just, oh yeah, anyway. Well, he made a prediction when I first met him, he found my YouTube, he sound, you seen no, you seen the advertisement of the Hobbit House, yep. and you said, I want to come over and do a YouTube for your YouTube channel, and that was it. Yep. And we've been friends ever since, and, and he told me, he said, he looked at me, he said, sir, he said, you're going to be a multimillionaire one day. He said, I can see this going bananas. Yep. You said it to me. Yep. It's blowing up. I, I, I mean, I literally go to bed at night, and one of my worries now is how am I going to provide material for people? Like, it's not, are we going to survive as a company? Are we doing this right? It's like, we bought so much stuff last year. We took all the Senko screws across the country. We took all the off-grid inverters across the country. Gosh. I mean, like, I went down the punch list, and I was like, so what's next year going to look like? <laughs> so, I mean, it's, it's well, been... Well, you predicted 250 of these to be sold. I believe in I predicted 67, so... I don't know. I'm, I'm hoping you win. Oh. I'm not pessimistic. It's winter time, the economy, the war, and all the world. But you know what? When you guys built this thing, and I know you guys are seeing this big window, when I seen this, I said, wow, 25 grand. I know we just sold the 16 footer for 15. This, this stomps that down. Oh, yeah. The value and the square footage and the size. This is a home, man. Everyone on the guy, every one of the guys that worked on the line have just been in awe of it. We've all walked in it and we're like, man, 
you can do a lot with it. Yes. I mean, and, and it's been fun because I've like creepered on the guys in different departments as they've been working on and just kind of leaned on the wall and listened to what they had to say. And they're like, I'm like, I'm thinking the same thing. Yeah. You know, that's nice. Yeah. Well, I don't want to get too far away with um, on this. I want, to, I want to go back to his minor. I want to offer to you all this minor can be installed in this house permanently and you can have the little screen where you can see the screen on at the time and however you want to do it. We will install it permanently in here, plug it up, ready to go. It'll be start mining as soon as you hit Wi-Fi and set it up. Yep. We'll do that for $100. And it's below the service panel. It can go right below it. Yeah. yeah. If so if you guys want this, it'll be, you know what? And if you win, we want to hear about it because you guys <laughs> yep. are going to hit it. $250,000, $250, something like that. Oh, Depending if it keeps market, going up. Yeah, if it keeps going up. I mean, right now, you and before the halving, you can get 6.25 Bitcoins. When it halves, it'll be three in the spring of next year. It's wow. going to have somewhere in the middle of the spring of next year. Yeah. And I mean, if it goes up to $100,000, then even with three, you'd have 300000 You know what we might do? And he's got a YouTube channel called Seven uh, Trumpets Preppers. Seven Trumpets Preppers. We also got Black Flag Crypto Mining Company. And Black Flag Crypto Mining Company. And I'm sure you will walk people through <laughs> yep. the tutorial of this if they need to. And we may do a couple more videos, I'm sure, on this. But for $100, all right? And that $100, get this, is going to him. It's not going to us. It's not going to ITH. It's going to him. He is, in, he, I, want, I want to help him get this going. Um, I want to see you guys maybe potentially win something or, you know, earn this. Oh, that'd make my day. And now, and of course, just like anything else, if you buy one, you get three and all this stuff, right? He's got these devices. He's working on a board that you can hook up six of these together. Five of them. Five of them together. Mm -hmm. So you could actually buy five for 500 bucks and have all five of them. And you'll never even know they're running. Never know, you'll just forget about them. They make no noise. And so you got five chances now of doing this. So why not line up? And you just forget about it. It's like buying a lottery ticket every day, but it gets cheaper and cheaper and cheaper to buy that ticket because the longer you're in it, yeah. yeah. Isn't that cool? Well, and one of the unique things about that too is the template resets. So after that's worked for a while, if it hasn't seen what it needs to see, it will restart and rework on the block. And he told me that the one that he's created is a third faster than any other of these devices you can get out of Amazon or across the world. There are other, he didn't invent this. This is like he, he is re, re, in reinventing it, adding to it. Right. And I love it because he's our family. He's, he's done this. He's made this box, this logo. I'm proud of him. Um, it's something that we can pass on to you guys. I love this whole idea. Can you imagine if somebody got that a payout in one of our tiny homes? Oh, yeah. Be just nice, man. Yeah. So give us a call. Let us know. Tell you what we'll do. We'll put it on the amenities page, right? So if you get a bay window, a mini split, egress window, two EMPs, get one of these babies. All right? Nice. 100 bucks. And now you got, you're ready to go and you get 25% off. Done. Yeah, I appreciate that, Randy. Yeah, and I hope I hope people do well with it. It was fun watching Tom get excited about oh, this God, morning. Yeah. I got him set up. I gave him one, put it on yeah. his desk. Aww. Helped walk him through it. Five minutes later, he's mining. Yeah, he's sitting right there on his office. Now, desk. if you want one yourself and you don't want one in the house and you just want us to mail you this one, hundred bucks. Let us know. Give us a call. Email us. Say, hey, I want Black Flag Black Flag Crypto Mining Company. What do you, what do you, what's this called? A, a treasure miner is what we call it. A treasure miner. Yeah. You want a treasure miner for $100, we'll ship this to him, right? Yep. 100 bucks, and that $100 goes right to this man right here. All right? 100%. That. I appreciate that. Man. All right. So you got till January 31st, buy this $25,000 house, 24 foot long. Please let us know what you think. Give your comments, thumbs up, and hope you guys have a massive turkey day. This is turkey day weekend. And um, we are all so thankful for everything where we're at, what we're doing. And believe us, our lives are not perfect, but I'm, I'm just glad I'm breathing. Oh, absolutely. I'm so glad that I'm just, I got eyes that I can see the colors of the sky. If I got to go down to the bare minimum, what I'm thankful for, I usually get out of bed feeling like, you know what? Them old legs are still moving. Oh, yeah. I, I'm grateful, man. When I come across that bridge to work with each day, I always make it a point to thank the Most High for one more sunrise. And as I leave, I always thank you for one more sunset. There you go. It's good times, man. Right. Good guy. Yeah. All right. Thank you all. Have a good weekend. Right. Bye. That's so cool.